Hey, it's Jay Morrison, and I want you guys to just take a few minutes out, get your notepad and a pen, and I'm gonna break down, uh, I'm gonna give a really simple lesson, easy lesson on why boycott. Three reasons why we all should participate in the Black Friday and Christmas boycott. Three simple reasons, just watch. All right, Jay Morrison, I wanna do a quick video for us on why boycott this Black Friday and this holiday season. Like three, easy simple reasons to understand why we're doing it and they were um i was enlightened and it all made sense from listening to the honorable minister farrakhan watching some of his old videos and seeing how this strategy right here the um not the obvious reasons why boycott like just to hurt the corporations or to make noise and all that not those obvious reasons but i want to talk about three reasons that really really penetrate and, and affect us one is unified action it's very important for us to do something together i know everybody has a different theory we have a different strategy and we all can debate around a table and figure out what we do but we've already figured out what to do with the justice or else one of the biggest movements in the country led by the most powerful man in black america so we already got the call to action we don't need to debate anymore let's just follow the leader we got to follow somebody at some time we can't just keep debating right so this unified action gets us in the habit to working together, or habit of working together. We don't work together enough. We say it, we talk it, but we really don't do it. So I'm not a part of Minister Farrakhan's organization or his religion, but I'm gonna support him in the Justice Rails movement a thousand percent, as I should. Because if I was in that position, I would want you to support me a thousand percent when I'm being authentic about offering solutions to help our people. So this unified action gets us practicing together, right? Playing on the same court, building chemistry, and getting small victories, right? Doing one boycott successfully before we get into, well, we should buy this and we should spend this and we should do this. We get it. Everybody knows that. It's a big comprehensive problem. We get that. We all, we're smart, we're in tune, we get it. But small victories build momo, momentum. That's what I call mo 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 momentum, momo. So small victories, okay. One small victory, 10, 10, 15, a million people in DC. Victory, another small victory, the Mizzou boycott with the college students. They got the chancellor and president to resign for racism. Victory, another small victory. Don't spend money Black Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Cyber, Cyber uh, Sunday, Cyber Monday. Don't spend any money. The stats will come out. It'll show that our unified action was a victory when the numbers tank and we save money. Boycotting is not a sacrifice. It's called savings. It's okay, black people. You don't have to spend your money. It's okay. It won't kill you to save sometimes. So don't think of boycotting as a sacrifice. Think of it as savings. Is savings. You, this, that's what it is. That's what it is. So next thing is that it does put politicians, the lobbyists that pay for the politicians' campaigns, and the corporations that give the lobbyists the money to pay for the politicians' campaign, it does put all of them on notice that we're not having it no more. You funding a politician that creates laws that adversely affect our people, that target us, that give us longer sentences, that oppress us. So everybody's on notice when we have a small victory from one boycott, the Black Friday weekend, and Cyber Monday, all the way through the holiday season of Christmas, right? Honor Christ, since Christmas is Christ's mass. So my Christmas is gonna be about service. I'm gonna give, do a, I'm doing a clothing drive. I'm gonna give food away. I'm gonna do more mentorship. I'm gonna do free workshops and free webinars on building wealth. I'm gonna serve this Christmas. I'm gonna give my service, which we all should do, and save my money, and save my family's money. So with that small victory, we build Momo, we get in the habit of unified action and get team chemistry. And now, the grand finale is, after the savings, after putting them on notice, after our small victory and the momentum now from the 
10, 10, 15, Million Man March, the Mizzou boycott successful, our Black Friday and Christmas boycott successful. We have unified action. So now we are used to working with each other now, right? So we're on the same page. So unity plus savings, right? Savings equals money equals power. Unity plus savings, meaning economics, us having chemistry working together. Now we have power. Peace. So I hope you enjoyed this video of kind of my uh, simplistic teaching on why boycott, why it makes sense. I think I broke it down pretty well. But make sure you follow these specific call to actions. One, if you're interested in unifying with the Justice or Else movement, right? These are the real people doing real work and really about the community and really in love with our people. If you want to be part of Justice or Else movement and support, text UNITY, U-N-I-T-Y, to 99000 and you can get all the details you want join our email list newsletter list get flyers on how you can promote and take action all that good stuff at justiceforelse.com so again text unity it costs you nothing to 99 for most of you got free texting anyway 99000 text the word unity to 99000 to be on our text list and, and organize with us and be be one with us get chemistry build chemistry with us um and go to justice or else.com so we'll make sure we're clear on that call to action and save your money this holiday season it's not a sacrifice it's savings boycott to build chemistry and unity to get momentum from a small victory to get savings which equals power which equals success which equals growth right and that's what we want to see so i love you all and um Thank you for watching this video.